Education. It is 10:49 in the morning. I got 11 minutes to record this and upload it before we have our awesome optional Zoom office hours with Mr. Cutter's class. Been having a lot of fun yesterday. <coughs> went outside for the first time and had. Well, I'm going to stay inside today because it's it's sunny, but it's not very warm. We will be doing the weather in a minute. Oh, I have someone trying to get in the door. I think they got. Stopped by their mother. Okay, so today is the last day of school before spring break. We will be coming back after spring break with more online education coming your way. Our first assignment in our class will be a human body systems Google slide. I'm going to put that assignment together over spring break and then assign it to you that Monday. Over spring break, I hope you spend time relaxing, de stressing, taking care of yourself. You can go outside, but you still need to maintain social distance. I know I've said this a lot, but it remains to be said. It's an important thing to say. We do have a celebration today. It is Mr. Z's birthday today, April 3rd. So happy birthday, Mr. Z. He typically has his birthday over spring break. I believe this is the first year he had his birthday while we were in school, but unfortunately we're not on campus. But Anyway, if you see Mr. Z um, online today or around, wish him a happy birthday. He's turning 33 today on, his, on April 3rd. Okay, so today's word, as you can see behind me, is plasma. Not a plasma TV, not the fourth state of matter plasma. This is blood plasma. It's the fluid part of the blood that contains water, dissolved nutrients, sugars, and proteins. It is, a, it is about 55% of the blood. Okay, and again, I kept that cool photo on there, or not a photo, um, illustration. Red blood cells, blood vessel, white blood cell, plasma. Check it out. Platelets are in there as well. So go ahead and check that out online. And um, remember that you're keeping updated your notebook every day with new vocab word. I think we'll have a quiz at some point. Hello. Maybe when we come back from spring break. Pop quiz on Monday. Probably not. But I think we might have a quiz that Thursday. It'll be on Google Forms, just like we did that one time in class. So be ready for that. I will let you know and give you a quiz review and all that. But we will be having quizzes. So, you know, something to look forward to maybe. Uh, before this video, I looked up some blood jokes. And I'm glad I didn't just start reading them because there were some pretty inappropriate ones. But my favorite one was two blood cells fell in love. But it was all in vain. So I'll leave that one for you today. Hey, it's Friday. Beautiful. Let's go ahead and do our weather. No notebook in that. Door. Oh, here's one. Let's go ahead and do second period. Haven't seen second period's notebook in a while. Let's go ahead and do our weather for second period. Yeah, last time we did is March 9th. And I'm going to go ahead and turn on the dot cam. Let's do it. Search, search. Yeah. Got a little concerned there. Got a little concerned, but we're all good. All right, so let's zoom in on this baby. All right, what do we got here today on weather? Do, 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 do. Remember, we're using the Rosedale station right down there by Gales, which is still open. Take it to go. All right, Rosedale house. Ooh, it's cold. Hopefully you got some warm clothes if you're going for a walk today. All right, let's see, March. March, oh my gosh, already April 3rd, 20. Ten fifty-three. if we were still in school in one minute, we would be going out on break, but we're not. 53.8. 
All right, let's see what 53.8 is. 53.8 F to C. This is, we've had a lot of temperatures in the 50s, so we should, I think we might have this one on here already. But anyway, raise your hand if you have a guess for the Celsius and the middle. 12.5, that's a great guess, but a little bit lower than that. Up front, yeah. 15, look at, um, in the back, 12.1, thank you, excellent guess, you guys are getting good at this, 12.1, Celsius, oh, pressure, ooh, ooh, exactly the same as last time, 30.00, oh, 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 baby, that is great, humidity, 68%, that's pretty good, as the day heats up, that will go down, it was pretty dry yesterday, but we will be getting some rain this weekend, so be advised. Wind speed, ooh, it's gusty, 5.8. Oh my gosh, that is our fastest of the year. I'm not getting much wind at my house, but uh, gusty down there in Capitola. And it is sunny. I would love to play our song, but we cannot because of copyright infringement. So maybe play it at your house. Let me focus that up a little bit. Um, let me turn on the light. Anyway, there's your weather for today. A little chilly out there, but take advantage of the sun this afternoon because it will be raining this weekend. And that's good because April showers bring May flowers is what they say. All right, so I'm going to sign off for today. I hope you have a great spring break. Get yourself rested up. Watch a cool show. Read a book. Get outside. Maintain social distancing. Wash your hand. All of that good stuff. I think I will throw up a couple videos over spring break, so keep an eye out for those. But otherwise, I will see you on April 14th, which is a Tuesday, because we do have a PD day as teachers that Monday. So you get an extra day than we do. So I will see you all on April 14th. And I also hopefully will see some of you in a minute at the Zoom meeting. But of course, you'll be watching the video after if you watch it. Okay, have a great spring break, and I will see you soon. Where's my song? Thank you.